why don't you tell us about the AMD motherboard with a soldered on A9 9820? Yeah. What is this thing? This is weird. I apparently it showed up on I think it was Alibaba. Okay. Um, and I, as far as I know, it is supposed to be the Xbox One SoC, which is which is weird. Um, I, I don't know why you would really want this so much anymore. Like an uh, Xbox One S, like not a Series S. Yeah, not a Series S. So what, Microsoft just like a bunch of these chips fell off the back of a truck? And so you can, like, I don't even understand what I'm looking at here. Like, cause the Xbox One yeah. S and One X use GDDR memory. So does this chip that would have been custom built for those consoles, does this chip also support regular, what looks like DDR4? Sorry, I, I can't actually tell that immediately from the notch here. Quite surprising. Uh, okay, so sorry, walk us through what, what else is going on here? DDR3. Luke dead. It's weird. It's weird. I, 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 no, I thought I had said something just a second ago, but um, it's, I, I don't, I don't get not only why it exists, but why you would really want it. <laughs> so what is it though? Seems to be what eight Jaguar cores then, um, with an AMD R seven three fifty GPU. Okay, um, maybe it's intended for like. I, I I I don't know. I'm really I'm really struggling here because uh, you're. I think you're muted or something, Luke. I'm trying to get my bird to go away. I'm sorry. <laughs> no worries. Do you want me to just talk through this one? No, you're good. You're good. I I it, it's it's weird. I I think the ultimate answer is like people don't really know because um, there's there's debate about what it is. There's some theory that it could be the the SOC, but. Uh, the RAM thing is weird. Like, why would it exist in this configuration? Like, may maybe this is the board that they used in the, um, uh, what what are those called? The like the like dev boxes that people get before the console comes out. Um, like, maybe this is the board they were using in that for some reason. Uh, that that could explain the RAM thing. Like, maybe this is just a really early version and they hadn't they hadn't fully converted it over yet. I don't know, but um, yeah, un unless some official information comes out and is like. Yes, this is definitely that. I could see some people wanting to like collect it for that reason, but outside of that, like I, I don't. Why would you, why would you want this? Yeah, um, there's this Chewy Aerobox Mini PC that uses a very similar motherboard to the Xbox One S. Um, so you know that's an example of what someone might do with a product like this. Like maybe they would try to you know, build like a weird knockoff console or something. I mean, given how bad AMD's Jaguar cores are by modern standards, it, I, I would not expect performance to be very good at all. But um, like there's there's comments on this article of the, the Chewy Aerobox. Like one of the first comments is, given how god awfully the Jaguar based AM1 chips aged, I'd avoid this like the plague. <laughs> With and that I said, I think that's fairly well said. With that said, it's 125 US dollars for a motherboard CPU and GPU. I mean, the CPU and GPU ain't anything special, but you always got to look at things within the context of what else you can get for that price. And you're looking at some pretty aging hardware for like. That, that's it, man. You got to get one. You got to do a build with it. Oh, oh, we've already got this on order. 100%. <laughs> 100%. Like we're we're gonna try it. I bet the power consumption is just like terrible. Yeah, I I don't I yeah I don't. I would I would just go used at that point. Like if I was trying to build a a, a cheap computer, I would just go used and probably get better stuff anyways.